Hello, hello, and welcome back to the channel. As most of you know, I'm Topher. And for those of you who don't know and just randomly decided to click on my video, welcome to the channel. I'm Topher. Thank you for stopping by. So we're here to do a reaction, and we're diving back into some more of One Direction. If you saw my channel update video for June 2022, I mentioned that there were two bands this month that I wanted to focus on a little bit, one being EXO and the other being One Direction. And I just finished reacting to a video of 14 vocals that are 14 times... Zane's vocals had me shook and then after reacting to that I saw in the recommended video 13 times Liam's vocals had me shook so I was like you know what why not let's just dive on in so that's what we're gonna do we're gonna dive on in and hopefully be shooketh by the vocals of Mr. Liam Payne uh yeah let's go Beautiful. So is this after Zane left? Similar, like when I was reacting to Zane's video, a couple of these concert clips, the audio quality is not the best. But I can hear what it's supposed to be, and I can hear what we're going for. So similar to Zane, he's got beautiful access to his head voice. I'm sure it was a beautiful riff, but I can't hear it. Hmm. I like the little bit like rock rasp on his voice. Whoever created this is clearly a fan of head voice. There's a beautiful transition up there, though.
<laughs> they love him. I was wondering when we were going to jump up there. Okay, a little bit of a belt. Oh, I mean, the title intrigues me. Okay, cute, cute, cute. So, yes, yeah, similar to um, Zane, like I said, there, he's got one of his strengths are his falsetto and his just his head voice in general. Um, very easy access to that, and it's that seems to be what's on display the majority of the time. Um, I think my not really issue. But with a lot of these compilation guides, like best vocals or vocals that have me shook, and it's not One Direction, it's just artists in general, because I watch a lot of these compilation videos for various artists on YouTube. Um, but one of the issues with some of these compilations that I come across is that the people who make them feel that like the best vocals are the highest vocals so all that ever gets featured is people screeching into the the stratosphere or you know doing their the highest parts of the register and they pay no attention to their chest voice or their lows and if you guys have been on my channel long enough y'all know that that is nine times out of ten my favorite part of people's voices i am all about the lows i'm all about the chest voice all those chest belts and just deliciousness that happen down here i'm all about that the head voice all the high stuff it's gorgeous it's beautiful it's impressive too but like i tend to favor all this stuff down here and it almost never gets featured in some of these compilations so like with this compilation 
Yes, his head voice is impressive. Everything he does up there is impressive. But about halfway through, I was starting to find myself getting a little bit bored. Not because what he was doing was bad, but because what was being featured was the same stuff for the entire like eight minutes. I think there was like one instance there. I think my favorite part of the compilation was actually whatever song it was where he was singing and he did a high note. And then afterward, the video just kept on for like another like 10 or 15 seconds. And he started just singing normally in his, you know, chest. And I was like, ooh, he's got a nice little rock rasp there on his, you know, on the upper part of his voice. I like that. I like that. Whatever song that was, that was probably my favorite part of the compilation because it was something different. It was a different part of his voice that was getting featured. And it was a part of his voice that I tend to gravitate to more towards. Um, so that's the only thing that only, I guess, a little bit of frustration I've come across in some of these um, compilation videos that, you know, people tend to think that the best is the highest. And it's like, for me, the highest is not always the best vocal. Um, and you can hear a lot of great skill and talent and tone in the lower parts of people's voices that you can't really hear in some of the parts when they're just screeching to the high heavens and, you know, hoping for the best. Um, so, like, yeah, his vocals are impressive. I just wanted some more variety in the actual video. So if you guys have suggestions as to other potential compilations that might show a little bit more vocal variety for him, let me know. Put that down in the comment section because, like I said, I, I want to get more into their music and just learn more about them as a group and individual solo artists as well. Um, yeah, so if you guys have... Uh, recommendation for a better compilation well, let me know but either way hope you guys enjoyed this reaction if you did don't forget to like comment subscribe share turn on notifications so you'll be notified when all of my shenanigans get posted um if you want to see more of my one direction reactions you can check out my one direction reaction playlist the link is down in the description um if there's anything else you'd like me to react to be sure to leave it down in the comments i'll get to it as soon as i possibly can if you'd like to support the channel in other ways you're more than welcome to join us over on patreon you don't have to but you're more than welcome to if you want to I'll see you guys in my next video. Love ya. Mwah. And before you guys go, a shout out to my amazing patrons. I can't begin to express how thankful I am for your support. And if you guys would like to join us over on Patreon, the link is down in the description. I love you guys.